my gorgeous darling Libra. Welcome to your love tarot reading. This is going to be for you and your person, my boo boo, whatever that means to you. Situation shrub, relationship, bumble date, marriage. Let's take a look at Leo, Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Oh my God. The tarot already gave me a card. Ace of Pentacles, a new beginning, boo boo. I think someone is crafting a message for you. Definitely crafting a message. Hmm. Three of Wands. Yeah, I think someone has recognized your value. Not to say they didn't before, but I think now it's like really like getting in there, you know, that old uh, old chestnut in here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you're, you're dealing with someone who's been obstinate. There's going to be a new beginning. A message is pending. Okay, we'll see what else the cards have to say. Uh, so yeah, Libra, this is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Let's do the read proper. Please show me angels. What's cap uh, happening for Libra and their person? Also, Libra, remember with these you versus them love tarot reads, we're assuming some kind of a rift or separation happening. Sun, sun in the air. Bip, bip. Aww. Aww. Oh, your person is like, mm, bad place, okay? Things are not looking so good. I'm, I'm laughing because, well, I mean, I'm not laughing at them, but I mean, they brought it on themselves, so. <laughs> um, also, Libra, if you're new to the channel, welcome to Blue Angel Love Tarot. And if you are a returning Blue Angel, thank you. I appreciate you. I see you, baby. I love you. Give me a kiss. Mm. Libra, you are so gorgeous. I love, I love reading for you because there's always someone who's tragically in love with the Libra, and we got one here, okay? So there is a rift. I feel like it's uh, definitely a break, at least a break, if not a complete, like, break up or separation here. Uh, whatever the nature of the connection is, you have the hang to me in. So hanging in there, okay? Somebody's hanging in there full of hope. Yeah, hope against hope that this is not forever, that this break is not forever. Interesting. Got the star at the bottom of the deck. So someone is remaining hopeful. Someone is still manifesting five of cups disappointment in the past. Someone someone was a disappointment to you and they know it, boo-boo. Uh, they do see you as the one they want to choose, the love of their life, the lovers. This is how they see you. But also, I feel like this person... Um, Boo -boo. Also, this person sees you as someone who has options. So they know that if this if this is going to be fixed in some kind of a way or healed, it's going to take, you know, it's going to have to be swift action on their part. So let's see what happened here, please, angels. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Uh, hmm, three of swords. Betrayal. Betrayal of the heart. Okay. Tell me more. <sighs> Oh, the star again. Okay, so this person promised you something. Okay, you've got death at the bottom of the deck, Libra. I do feel like it's definitely over. This person promised you something. They promised you uh, uh, some kind of a commitment. You've got the chariot here. They promised you in the past that things would move forward with you. Maybe this is someone who had been stalling you for a while, was not leaving, like, you know, their main person was like, you know, divorced, not divorced kind of thing. And, and you know, not with their person, but still like, you know, divorce pending kind of thing. And they were like, you know, just Give me a year. Give me two months. Whatever, whatever. I need more time. And then I'll make that commitment. We're going to go forward. They were trying to like, you know, not juggle, but kind of make two worlds meet, let's say. They promised you everything. The moon, the stars. They promised you a UFO. You know, like everything. Like, do you want a pony? You can have a pony. If you want a UFO, you can have a UFO. You know what I'm saying? Like, they were like, mm, Libra, I'll give you anything you want. None of it came true. Uh, and they broke your heart because they broke a promise. So it could have been it could have been anything, could have been taking things to the next level in some kind of a way. I strongly feel that it is someone, if it's a long-term connection, it's someone who has had you in a third-party situation. Uh, not in the sense that they were in love with two people, but, boo, but that they, like, whatever finish they had in a past connection was not finished. So they weren't 100% divorced or they were still living with an ex or something like that, but, boo. And they kept promising things would, uh, you know, get finalized between the two of you. Uh, I also see um, that your heart was broken because your person, you know, could have, like, halted something. Like, halted a move together. You were supposed to move in together. You were supposed to go somewhere together, get married, whatever it was. They halted that. And it was very, very heartbreaking. It was a horrible, heart heartbreaking situation for you, Bill. Oh, but see, now they realize that their life is kind of hanging upside down at the moment without you. You know, things are not what they, uh, things are not what they want them to be. Uh, so, hmm, hmm. So why did this person, uh, 
Why did this person do this? I mean, we don't need to ask. It's a douche flute, right? Um, yeah, be careful, Bibu, because something came out about this person. There is a moment of clarity, the sun. Um, yeah, for some of you, this person is stalling you on taking things to the next level because they don't want to be seen with you because you're not as uh, single as they appear. Especially if it's a bimbo himbo from Tinder, anyone between you met on a Tuesday. This is someone who love bombed you. They were like adamant, like straight away, we need to be in a relationship where like, you know, let's put a label on it, you know, whatever, like uh, change your um, status on freaking Facebook or something. And like... <laughs> immediately after like the chariot was reversed so like you know whatever like action there was going forward it was halted because this person was always going to break your heart because they were just love bombing you because they were not as available as they said they are um in whatever way maybe it's not like a past relationship they just weren't emotionally available in whatever way and you found something out about them you confronted them you know, the star and the sun, because you were you're like, you became the alpha and the omega. Like, you realized something about the situation. You called them out and, you know, ghost. Or uh, it's a runaway situation. Like, someone ran away from you, boo-boo. This, <laughs> this person would like to win with you in some kind of a way. I'm not sure, Libra, if this is the best person to be dealing with. Because they want to win. Right now, they want to win. They want to win the argument. They want to win the, whatever, gaslighting competition. They want to gaslight you, basically. They want you to fall into their, um, into their traps, into their, you know, propaganda, whatever it is that they're trying to do here. Uh, I don't necessarily see any action coming through, uh, right, if you're watching this in August 2022, although it is a timeless reading, so I never find you as meant for you, boo-boo. But in August 22, um, I don't think their energy is for August for this person to come in. Justice. I think something will turn in your karma. See, this is your own card again in your reading. Boo-boo. This almost, almost every time. Almost. Justice for Libra. So there will be justice for Libra, boo-boo. Uh, Libra sees it. I feel like this person will try and do something that uh, will try and, like, right the wrongs, you know, make everything better. We're coming into Virgo season already, and then, then it's Libra. It's it's really not very long, but it might seem like forever, but it doesn't have to be. So, you know, take these messages with a grain of salt, especially when it comes to timing. It's a slippery fish, and, you know, this is just a reading on the Internet, so it is a general energy thing. Um, but I do feel like um, by Libra season or in Libra season, things will become super, super clear for you with this person. This could be a, an ongoing, stretched-out situation with someone who's a slow mover and who's someone who's slow to apologize slow to do anything really you know someone who's in two minds about everything the hanged man uh let's see if there's any advice here for libra i mean you're in your power anyway because that justice card is telling me that you are in your power 100 percent could be earlier you know anytime between now and libra season things will come to a head yeah king of pentacles so you know think about how much stability you have without this person are you happy without this person because i feel like you're doing just fine without them you know um did they give you stability did someone take money from you did someone take things from you did some did they nourish you did they did they keep you moisturized did they buy you beautiful you know like <laughs> honey infused oils and you know moisture things creams and perfumes or did and the, did they worship you boo -boo? or did they take and take and take and expect you to worship them so you know that th that is probably going to affect how you judge this person and and how you want to go forward in the situation boo -boo. but it's also saying you know king of pentacles is someone queen anyone between boo -boo, gender is arbitrary but you know that figure is someone who has the golden touch so you can you know you have a lot of other options there's a lot of options that beautiful pentacle here is your heart you can give it to whoever you want it doesn't have to be this person but it can if you want to be boo because it's all about free will my darling uh let me know in the comments below my darling libra if this resonated for you and uh if you vibe with my channel and you enjoy my videos why not subscribe turn on that notification button and of course like the video because liking the video really helps me out as a small creator on youtube i'll see you next time my darling libra i forgot to to tell you if you want to get a personal reading with me all the information is down below um and yeah my darling stay moisturized stay golden with that golden touch stay gorgeous and may the angels protect you boo boo